Imagine growing crocs without soil. Sounds like science fiction, right? But it's real, and it's called soilless farming. This innovative approach to cultivation has revolutionized the way we grow fruits and vegetables, offering a sustainable solution to traditional farming challenges. Here in this video, we will explore some soilless farming techniques, from hydroponics to aeroponics. We'll uncover how these innovative methods are changing the game in food production. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get regular updates. Let's get started. Understanding Soilless Farming Techniques Soilless farming encompasses various methods, each tailored to suit different environmental conditions and crop types. The primary techniques include hydroponics, aeroponics, and aquaponics. Let's start one by one. Hydroponics Hydroponics is a method of growing plants where they are cultivated specially. Instead of planting them in soil, they're placed in a solution that's full of nutrients. The roots of the plants dangle in this solution, soaking up the necessary nourishment. This unique technique offers a high level of control over various factors crucial for plant growth, such as the amount of nutrients present, the pH level of the solution, and other environmental conditions. By carefully managing these elements, hydroponic systems can optimize the growth and yield of plants. When it comes to the types of crops that flourish in hydroponic systems, there's quite a diverse selection. Leafy greens are particularly well-suited for this method, Think about lettuce, spinach, kale, and Swiss chard. These veggies thrive in hydroponic environments. Their ability to absorb nutrients directly from the solution makes them grow lush and healthy. Additionally, herbs like basil, cilantro, mint, and parsley also love the hydroponic setup. With the right conditions, these herbs can grow abundantly, providing a fresh and flavorful addition to any meal. One of the advantages of growing plants hydroponically is the flexibility it offers in terms of harvesting. Leafy greens and herbs can be harvested multiple times during their growing cycle. This means that you can continuously enjoy a fresh supply of these tasty greens without waiting for a whole new crop to grow. It's like having a mini garden that keeps on giving. This frequent harvesting not only ensures a steady stream of produce, but also encourages the plants to keep growing vigorously. Aeroponics. Aeroponics is a modern method of growing plants that doesn't rely on soil. Instead, plants are grown in an environment where their roots hang in the air. Nutrients essential for growth are delivered to the roots in the form of a mist. This mist is sprayed onto the roots at regular intervals. This method is highly efficient in providing plants with the nutrients they need, which leads to fast growth and healthy development. One of the great advantages of aeroponics is its suitability for growing a variety of crops. It's particularly well-suited for fruits and vegetables like tomatoes, cucumbers, bell peppers, and strawberries. These plants thrive in aeroponic systems, benefiting from the direct delivery of nutrients to their roots. When it comes to harvesting, aeroponic systems offer some notable benefits. Tomatoes, cucumbers, and bell peppers, for example, tend to yield a significant amount of produce per plant when grown aeroponically. By carefully managing the nutrient levels and controlling the environment, growers can ensure that these plants reach their full potential. Moreover, aeroponic cultivation can result in strawberries that are not only larger, but also sweeter compared to those grown in traditional soil. This is because the aeroponic environment allows for precise control over factors like nutrient concentration and humidity, which can enhance the flavor and size of the berries. As a result, aeroponic strawberries often offer a more desirable taste and appearance, making them a popular choice for growers looking to produce high-quality fruit. Aquaponics Aquaponic systems are innovative setups that bring together aquaculture, which is fish farming, with hydroponics. Imagine a partnership between fish and plants where they both help each other out. Here's how it works. The fish produce waste, which might not sound appealing, but it's a valuable resource in this system. That waste contains nutrients that the plants need to grow. So the plants absorb these nutrients, essentially cleaning the water for the fish by doing so. It's like a natural filtration system, where each participant benefits from the other's actions. This setup forms a self-sustaining ecosystem where water is efficiently used and waste is minimized. When it comes to what you can grow in aquaponic systems, the options are quite diverse. You can nurture a variety of crops ranging from leafy greens like lettuce and spinach to herbs like basil and mint and even fruits like tomatoes and peppers. The versatility of aquaponics allows for a wide array of plants to thrive, 
making it suitable for different culinary preferences and dietary needs. Plus, since the plants get their nutrients from the fish waste, you can enjoy organically grown produce without the need for synthetic fertilizers or pesticides. One of the perks of using aquaponic systems, similar to hydroponics, is the flexibility in harvesting times. Unlike traditional farming, where you have to wait for the entire crop cycle to finish before harvesting, in aquaponics, you can harvest crops multiple times as they grow. This means you can enjoy a continuous supply of fresh produce without long waiting periods between harvests. Harvesting and Yield in Soilless Farming Soilless farming offers significant advantages that contribute to maximizing crop yield while minimizing resource usage. In traditional soil-based farming, harvesting usually occurs in cycles, but soilless systems often allow for continuous harvesting. This means plants can reach maturity quicker, resulting in a higher yield over time. The precise control over growing conditions in soilless farming is a key factor in its success. Farmers can adjust factors like temperature, humidity, and nutrient levels to optimize plant growth. This level of control enables year-round cultivation, overcoming the limitations imposed by seasonal changes and adverse weather conditions. Unlike traditional farming, which is heavily dependent on favorable weather, soilless farming can operate consistently regardless of external factors. Another advantage of soilless farming is its efficient use of water. Compared to traditional methods, soilless systems require less water to grow crops. This makes soilless farming a more sustainable option, particularly in regions where water scarcity is a concern. By minimizing water usage, soilless farming helps conserve this precious resource and reduces the environmental impact of agriculture. Moreover, soilless farming opens up possibilities for vertical farming. In this approach, crops are cultivated in stacked layers, making efficient use of vertical space. This vertical integration allows farmers to maximize land utilization and increase overall yield per square meter. Vertical farming is especially beneficial in urban environments where arable land is limited. By utilizing vertical space, soilless farming enables urban agriculture to thrive, providing fresh produce to densely populated areas. Unlocking the potential of soilless farming. Soilless farming is like a new way of growing plants without using traditional soil. Instead, it uses techniques like hydroponics, aeroponics, and aquaponics. These methods don't need a lot of land and use less water compared to regular farming. They also help fight climate change by reducing greenhouse gas emissions. One of the cool things about soilless farming is that it can be done in different places. You can find it in cities where space is limited or even in deserts where soil quality is poor. Scientists are even experimenting with soilless farming in space stations. This means it can help feed people no matter where they live. As technology gets better, soilless farming is likely to get even more amazing. Scientists and farmers are always coming up with new ideas to make it work even better. This could mean growing more food with fewer resources, which is super important as the world's population keeps growing. So soilless farming isn't just a solution for today, it's also a big part of how we'll feed ourselves in the future. That's all for now. I hope you have enjoyed watching the video. If you have any questions regarding the video, you can ask in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and share the video and follow us for more updates. Thanks for watching.